moving a Connex. Now you move one. And there she goes. This is how you move a Connex. You just need a dozer, that's all. So what we're doing is we're going to move these out, flatten out an area, and then get them back situated. set them 20 foot apart and we're going to build a container shop out of these things. So, we'll do that in another video. Let's see how this turns out. It's looking good so far though. One there, one here. I'm gonna put a carport from that edge to this edge. And, uh, yeah, that's it. That's how it's gonna look. Let's see what it looks like. See, that one looked okay, but it might actually need to bump it that way just a little bit. We'll see. We got a tape measure. So now we're just shoving them around, trying to get them evened up, and we gotta be. 19 foot inside to inside that way our carport can sit up there on that that rail that's right up here at the top set our carport up there so now we're just shoving them around trying to square them up and even them up in the process of setting piers now you can see this we got it pretty close on the dirt work but i wanted them a little raised so they wasn't just sitting on the ground so now we're in the process of doing that get a few of these set and i'll show y'all how we did it now we got railroad ties under there with blocks on them some of these are just temporary piers we'll end up moving those because they're crooked they were just to get it set so that's basically it. These are leveled out up off the ground like I wanted them. This one's got a little bit of a jump. I may build up some around it or either build a ramp going to it or something. That one over there ain't as bad, but they should be level with each other. So what we did to level them with each other is I took set the transit, and then we took the transit stick, went along this bottom rail right here with it, got them leveled. Now, I did tilt them a little bit out this way that way hopefully all the water will drain off this side they got about a about a half to one inch drop coming to the outside so uh but they're pretty square with each other and uh they ought to do fine well i hope this video helps somebody y'all have a good afternoon we're gonna finish blocking this one up so both connexes are in place now he's gonna slick all this up I'm going to start spreading gravel and uh, yeah.